Hey guys and gals, this is Military Comedy with the return to Kingdoms and Castles. I guess you could call it a return. I never really left, but at the same time, like, I've just been kind of, um, a little bit dormant on it. Partially because the last few videos I've done on this, uh, haven't really been getting very many likes or very many views. Um, so that being said, please leave a like if you want to see more of Kingdoms and Castles in the future. And obviously watch to the end because that does tremendous amounts to uh, to help me possibly get mon monetized eventually and then be able to provide uh, better videos and better games and such. Um, part of the reason why I had kind of stopped doing Kingdoms and Castles was because I'm almost out of stuff to do other than um, just like sheer expanding to conquer the rest of this island, which I think is what some people want to see me do. Um, that also reminds me, I believe I was going to name this after one of my uh, one of my very loyal subscribers so this will be the dock of Colin I believe it's Brody let me just double check that real quick gotta gotta go onto my phone's YouTube to check it but anyways how's everybody's day going I know that I've had a um, it, it's a been a day um, this morning kind of sucked with work Colin Brogan is his name um, cause I was at work, uh, they had, uh, called me in late. Normally I'll start at, alright, normally I'll start at 7pm, but for whatever reason they decided they wanted me to start at 7am. So I, I went in at 7am, did as I was told, and, uh, they had me leave at, or I went in at, uh, 10pm, and, um, did as I was told, and then I left around, give or take, 3.30, and uh, that's only five hours of work and this kind of stuff just keeps happening like I'm not signed off as a part-time worker by any means but for whatever reason it feels like every day I'm getting closer and closer to being just a part-time worker there and it's very frustrating because I need this job like I want to move out of my family's house so I either need to uh, th either this job needs to get its act together or I'm gonna have to start looking for a new job and I would really prefer not to have to look for a new job because that would be a a task and a half right there considering I, I've literally just left like a whole bunch of jobs recently uh, so that being said maybe I could make YouTube a career if I get like 10,000 subscribers and I start making a few hundred bucks a month but um, that odds are that's not gonna happen for a very very long time and so I'm not planning on that happening for a very very long time um, but that being said I do want to start expanding a little bit more on my YouTube I want to start making um, or at least I want to start trying to make more videos a day maybe two videos a day something like that and just make it more enjoyable for you guys another thing i had uh i, I keep getting sidetracked another thing someone had recommended i do was uh build a bridge over here because i've been an idiot and did not have a bridge there so thank you for whoever recommended that i forget your name i'm very sorry about that uh, i have the memory of a three-year-old probably from all the concussions i got playing football um so yeah that kind of kills my memory a lot and so if I if I forget people's names, I'm sorry. If I literally do not have it pulled out, I'm going to forget it because I'm just that horrible with memory. Uh, this also reminds me, I need to destroy this moat here. Demolish? How are you guys doing for happiness anyway? 67 and 61. What are you so... Why are you happier? Ah, you have a, the view of water. Uh, you guys aren't very happy though, and I'm imagining it's got to do with... You guys don't have... A church anywhere nearby and that usually affects you guys' happiness really bad all right so uh, I can't really this is a bad area to start building houses in. I think up well this is gonna be my farmland too Ugh! I have to find a spot I don't know where oh well, just I'm just gonna keep building up here see what I can do up here I know I need to uh, work on getting more villagers eventually because I think the maximum amount of villagers you can have is 10 th or uh, 5,000 and I'm at like 800 with these two combined. So that's my goal is to get all the way up there. Uh, you guys actually have a lot of resources, but no coal. So that being said, where's my, my charcoal? There we go. Charcoal there, charcoal there. Make this place a little bit happier. All right. Um, what's with all oh, I forgot that this thing makes trees. Oh, well. Let's see. What can I do? What? Oh, what? Oh, what can I do? Definitely need to expand more. Like finish off the uh, finish off this island over here, which is gonna kind of suck because I didn't put it to the waterline, like the idiot I am, and so that's gonna. I'm, I basically just wasted a lot of resources, but <gasps> oh hiccups. But at this point, it doesn't exactly matter because I've got so many resources anyways. 
Uh, so... Oh, I don't have enough. I'm gonna speed this up a little bit more. I could actually build some piers there. That would be cool, I think. Let's see. One there. Oh, that's all I can build. And that's all she wrote, boys. <laughs> Come on. I wonder if there's some kind of way you could have, like, a little aqueduct. They're not an aqueduct. Um, I'm trying to think what it would be called. Like, a, a water gate, kind of? Like, I know they've had them in cities. I think I think Carthage was famous for it back in medieval history. But I don't actually remember. The water gates of Carthage or the shipyards of Carthage? Something along those lines. I love history, but I'm not the best at it, so don't don't hate me for that. Uh, happiness is 85 here, which is actually pretty high. Uh, one thing I do need if I want to eventually start taxing these people is a tax collector, but that island is so small, I doubt that's really going to be needed. Um, I don't know what to do. I know I need to get more housing areas, and I know I have a lot of like just extra land. Eh, we'll figure out something. In the meantime, I think this is going to be my priority, finishing this off. Yeah, I have no idea how to make a water gate. I don't think you can in this game, so I'm just going to kind of leave that there. 38 people visited, but only 4 found satisfactory homes. Well, that's a problem, ain't it? Um, don't have enough stone for that. I was going to build that manor over here, might as well, I figured, but... Gotta wait. Come on, hurry up. I believe in you. Um, and I, I can't even build it over there? Why can't I build it there? Why not? What's wrong with that spot? There's nothing there. What? Game. Why do you do this to me? Oh well. So that just means that... Is this church even accessible? I think it is. Oh, uh, Master Priests. What is this for anyways? I don't actually know what the Great Hall does. If anyone knows what the Great Hall does, please let me know in the comments because I've been curious. I built it because it, like it's something to build. Um... And that is one thing I do hate about this game is that it is kind of small, or at least right now, because it is early access, so it doesn't, it's not a complete game. And so you run out of stuff to do, like, uh, other than Viking invasions, dragons, plagues, and merchants, that's about the only events that really ever happened in this game, that I know of, unless they added more since the last time I played. It has been a couple weeks, but I didn't see a, um, like anything telling me there was an update, so I can't imagine there was an update. But there might have been, I could be wrong. I'm not exactly the best to uh, listen to because I'm a bit of an idiot sometimes. Alright. I'm almost done with these piers. So make me happy when it's done. I do need more stone. But I don't think I have stone anywhere to build more stone. Down here I could just demolish those. Do it. That was not what I wanted to do. Oh, I do that so much. I hate that. And then up here. Oh, I could get that. Get rid. Of, I'm going to get rid of that. That's a good idea. Thank you, myself. There we go. And let's uh, get one more pier. And finish this uh, seawall. Oh, two more piers. I knew that. I don't I don't know what you guys are talking about. I'm not an idiot at all. Um, so over here, I need a drawbridge. Cool. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave this area here just completely surrounded by, like, or well, it's like my kind of keep, my uh, inner sanctum. And then more out here is just going to be more like villages and such. It's not going to have any like real industry. If I can avoid it, that is. I'm going to try to avoid having industry down there. Uh, I also really do need more villagers. I'm just hurting for villagers. So that being said, if I build... Ah, oh, crap. It's winter time and I can't tell like the how good recent, like plots of land down here are. Come on, hurry up. Finish that up. There we go. So, oh man, all of this is actually really good farmland. I can't really convince, I can't convince myself to do it. Alright, so my solution then, Cloud, move out of the way. Dragon sighted. Someone also uh, asked me to stay over the dragons and like Vikings when they attack so that they can see all the action. So that being said, I'll stay here and I'll let you guys watch this dragon go to war with my ballistas and my archer towers and see how he does. I don't think he's I don't think he's gonna last very long. I get that feeling that he's gonna fall down and damage one of my buildings pretty soon. Or take out an archer tower. Nope. Just hurt the stone wall. There we go, we slayed a dragon. We're the best fighters in the game. Alright, so this here is basically gonna all be farmland. So one, two, three, one, two, three, then down here. And then one, two. 
So I have to build it. So I, over here it looks like it's more fertile. So one, two, three, or one, two, three, and then here. Yeah, that'll do. Probably. Partially, at least. It'll do enough. Alright, so over, like, all this area here is just gonna become straight farmland. Nothing else. That being said, I do need to finish my walls. This little expansion I've got going on here is literally gonna encompass the entire island. This is gonna become a fortress. It'll be, this will be, this is gonna be more defended than Azkaban. That is my goal, for this to be as strong as Azkaban. Doubt it's actually gonna ever get there, because Azkaban is, it's just insanely well defended, but... It's possible. I don't know why I even bothered to build this dock, if I'm being completely honest. It kind of serves no purpose. And I have just a one, like, ah, I keep getting distracted so easily, because I was meaning to build, um, a little residential area over here. So, that being said, we're going to need a church. We do not have the stone for a church. We're going to need a tavern. Gonna need stone. Alright, so, church is gonna go right here. No, actually, I think it would be better to have the church and tavern down there. Let's just keep expanding out this bridge. That is not what I wanted to do. Delete that. Alright, so, church. You need more stone. Stone producer, or miners, get to work. Hurry up. Stop being so slow. So much wood over here, too. There's just so much resources just lying around everywhere. Alright, we almost have enough for that church, because I just want to see how big it is. So if I put it right here, I would have enough room to build the tavern right next to it. Oh, actually, I could build that town square right here. And then chop these down, and the rest of this wood. I'm gonna take all of this down, so that this becomes housing, dist uh, housing district. Come on. Oh, got a new merchant. They don't really have uh, too much. Sometimes they have special items on them, like or special upgrades. I haven't really been getting that lucky. Ooh, special item. Uh, improved construction technique. Re reduces construction costs by 10% for wood and 5% for stone. Heck yeah, I'll buy that. Um, I don't know what I bought it with, actually, but... It said fourteen fifty. Was that gold? Did I just lose all my gold? I don't actually know. Whatever. Alright, so I've got that being produced down here. Where is my tavern? It's gonna be right there. And manor's gonna go up. Right there. Right there. And what can I fit over here? Is indeed the question for today. Can't fit a market. Don't know why I thought I could fit a market for some odd reason, but. Could actually build a, uh, actually. I have technology, so I could fit that market over there. Actually, that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, I love being able to build these piers. They're so useful. And that being said, I actually really do need more villagers, because I'm kind of hurting for uh, that workforce. That's why I'm building all this stuff so heavily down here. Alright. Build that. And so that's gonna be completely taken. One, two. So down two. This will be my new, uh, my next residential little platform. And then over yonder, I'm gonna build more residential things. Ooh, this is coming along nicely. I'm really starting to, uh, like this outer wall looking thing. And then up here will be my food if I need it. Oh, actually, never mind. I was looking at food for some reason when I was, uh, when I did that trade, but it wasn't food that I was selling or giving, it was gold. Okay, now I got another merchant going the long way around my uh, my civilization, but hey, all the power to you. Gotta chop those two down eventually, too. Gotta build these manors up. Build that one. Can't build another one for a minute. But once he's ready, I think I might actually put a baker right there. Because I think I'm going to have an extra space. Come on, hurry up. There we go. And where's my, how much does my baker cost? I need 24 stone. That's weird, because I used to need 20. Oh, yeah, because I got that little debuff, or decrease. Would it, a buff on my resources? I don't know. Words are difficult. 
terms are hard for me too. I'm not I'm not intelligent enough for this. All right. So hurry up, game. You guys just need to build faster. Dang. And all right. So now I'm yeah I gotta speed this up because this is taking way too long to build everything. On the bright side, the town square is almost done. On the not so bright side, nothing else looks like it's almost done except maybe the tavern. I mean that doesn't really serve too much purpose. I'm getting so much extra food. I got nothing to worry about over here. How's how are you guys doing over here? Happiness of 100. That's insane. What are you guys at? You're at 102, 102, and 96. You don't have access to a well. That's what's making you mad. Okay, so I'll just I'll just build that right there. <laughs> the entire island has well coverage now. Oh, that's actually that's one thing I didn't think about over here. I do need a well. So probably right there. Hopefully that reaches everyone. If, and I'm gonna build one right there because I believe that'll reach everyone then. And my farms are flooding. This is gonna be bad news for my uh, my food supplies, my food stores. I don't know how to check if uh yeah I've got no idea I was gonna check to see if they were flooding but for some reason it doesn't show it when I click on it I thought it did but probably wrong on that you guys almost done with this pier hurry up guys I want this little residential area to be done finished building so I can actually uh get the units for it get a return for my investment and there goes the rest of my my stone Holy crap, we're just, we're just hurting for stone all around. There's a stone mine down there that I haven't tapped into. I could do that. It's going to take a hot minute to build down to, though, but hey, might as well. So, chop, 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 chop. Hopefully I got everything. Chop, chop. I might miss one or two while I'm going down this way, and then I'll just get them later, but... Chop, 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 chop. Keep on chopping, boys. Chop. Dang. Chop, chop, chop. 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 Alright. And then I believe we're going to need rock removal around it. So we'll do that. And then this one's ready to be removed. Complete removal. Oh, now we have the tavern so people can get food or, uh beer if they they if they feel so inclined instead of just living off of uh, bread and water and we have the market being produced too oh I really am starting to like this this is kind of kind of cool looking all right and I got a decent amount of stone to keep building up my wall um I don't know how I'm gonna defend this yet either I know I have to defend it somehow why is this one higher than the rest I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to have to build some kind of defenses on this eventually, but for now I have no idea what I want to do. Probably just going to build a whole bunch of ballistas, if I'm being honest. So, build two high. Build... Alright, let one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. With eight in between, I guess, I'll do. And then I'll have uh, ballistas on top of those. And ballista here. And just keep going down like that. I think that'll work. How are you guys building down here? Everything looks like it's coming along nicely. A little bit slowly, but is to be expected. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And another ballista. Ballista, ballista. I've never actually heard it, or I've never been given a definitive pronunciation for that one. Because it seems like every word in the English dictionary, or the English language, has like 18 different pronunciations. Or not 18, at least two usually, and I hate that. Because, like, it, for instance, the and the, it's the same word, same concept, just different pronunciations. And they do have, like, little areas where they make more sense, like, this is the, like, you well, I'm trying to think, because honestly... You could say it either way, like with a baron, this is the baron of hamburger or something like that. Or you could say, oh, this is the baron of hamburger. And either way, it makes grammatical sense. But I, what am I doing? I'm going off on an English lecture now. Six people visited, but none could find a home. Our city is lol. 
Is that what it says? Okay, lol. I don't know. That's a word that I've I've heard before, and I believe it means like kind of stagnant, but I I don't know. I've never heard it used in this context before. I don't know. So we've got ballistas being built. Got this town district being built. That's gotta hurry up. I'm gonna speed this up. Because this is my goal for the episode, to finish off this little town district. Oh, and that reminds me, I need to finish off the road, too. There we go. Oh, man, this is going to take a hot minute. Everyone's just such slow, build such slow builders. Oh, and actually, I could build a bridge here, too, if I had, uh, if I felt so inclined. Alright, so let's see. So we have one, two... Three, four. So actually, one, two, three, four, five. So theoretically, I could build more manors here too, which I might. Oh, well, I should probably gonna do. Oh, finally have some manors built. They want charcoal, but they'll get charcoal in time. That's just gonna be a matter of time. So, that being said, over yonder. Um. I'm going to build a bridge across too, except it's going to be over here. Technically the quickest route would be right there, but I want to build more manors here. I want to have um, a little bit of an extensive bridging platform here. And then build that pier right here. And then I'm going to have the manors facing that way, and then I'm going to have manors facing this way. So that way, kind of maximizing the amount of manners we've got. What is happening to all my food? I think we might need to build more farms. So, that being said, right here would be a good spot to build a couple orchards. And then over here would be some good spots for food, for farms. Why am I having such difficulty finding the farms? One, two, three. One, two built one two and destroy that and get those windmills in for the extra bonus and just like that we've probably fixed our food crisis my bustling city is becoming bigger and bigger as the day goes by I love this so much I just love the feel of this uh, my empire all right that's the entrance right there that's the entrance down there. Right there. Uh, how long have I been recording? Uh, I'm about 20 odd minutes in. I'll finish up, a, or I'll keep building for a little bit longer. And then I gotta end this episode soon. So, that being said, I have a little bit more stone. So, right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Build that a little higher. And get that tower in. Atta boy. And then I also got to um, keep building here so that these are three high. I don't know why I decided three high is what I wanted for everything, but for some odd reason, that's what... Actually, I think I do know why, because I think without other support, that's the max you can get is three high. Like, one single wall can only get three high without having a wall next to it. Fire has claimed a ballista tower. Really? It's raining. How does fire claim a ballista tower in the friggin' rain? Ugh. Who knows? Nobody knows. Uh, you're at 104 happiness. You're at 102. Everybody here is building. The pier is being built. Well, I think this is a good time to end the episode. So if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching the entire video. Um, as always, please leave a like and consider subscribing if you're not subscribed already. And I hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching.